Yo, what's going on people? It's your boy Ape Hancho back at you again with another video. And there's been some updates into the Crosslam Davis murder trial, and for any of you wondering who that is, that's Biss from Harlem Spartans. Now, I know it's been a little minute since we heard any news from this situation, and I know a lot of people have been waiting for updates in regards to what exactly is going on, but that is just what happens in regards to court hearings. It does take a little while for things to move forward, and on top of that, because of the pandemic, it probably pushed everything back, which made this whole situation even longer. But before we get into the most recent updates, let's go through everything we know so far and catch you lot up just in case you forgot or maybe some of you are not aware of this situation. So on the 6th of December 2019, around 3.30am, police were called to Bronze Street in Deptford following reports of a stabbing. When they arrived, they were going to find Crosslam Davis, also known as Biss, suffering from stab injuries and he would unfortunately go on to be pronounced dead at the scene. A witness to the attack told local reporters it began at the north end of Creekside and Biss was chased by quote five or six guys with knives and a baseball bat. They continued I heard shouting and saw them fighting. It was a guy on his own in reference to Biss. He ran from under the bridge to the alleyway and came to a stop. One of them had a bat and I shouted at them leave him alone. I'm going to call the old Bill. And one of them looked up at me and said, watch I don't burn your house down. The man fell again in reference to Biss, lying against the wall. Three of the men were laying into him. Someone walked past and stopped to help, and the kid laid on the floor on his back, and that's where he died. The police came and gave him CPR, and it seemed like he was on his own. The arguing came from up the road, but it was so dark I couldn't ID them. I didn't realise he'd been stabbed, I thought they were just laying into him. Initially, no one had been arrested, but in early 2020, three men, that being Elijah Morgan, Jedi Param, and Dejon De Costa, alongside a 17-year-old who can't be named for legal reasons, would go on to be arrested and charged in connection with this incident. Both Elijah and Jediah would go on to be charged with murder, with Elijah having a further charge of possession of an offensive weapon, and Jediah having a further charge of possession of points and blades. Dejon was charged with perverting the course of justice. But again, I have been keeping an eye on this whole situation, and the trial was supposed to go ahead in July of 2020, but I do believe the pandemic pushed the date back. But both Elijah and Jediah have been making court appearances, with today the 8th of February marking the first day of the trial, but all isn't what it seems, so just bear with me a second. If we head over to the court listings for today, you can see it says here, Court 9 at 11am, new trial in the case of Elijah Morgan, 19, accused of murder. Drill rapper Crosslam Davis, 20, also known as Biss, was fatally wounded on Bronze Street, Depth. Bedford, South East London on December 6, 2019. He was a member of the Harlem Spartans music group based in Kenneton. But in the most recent updates, if we head over to the law pages, the website reads that although the trial did go ahead today, it was now being classed as trial ineffective. Now you might be asking yourself, well, what does that mean? Well, according to the Law Pages website, an ineffective trial means that the trial cannot go ahead on this date, but will be heard again at another time. And from doing some research online, apparently it means the defense doesn't have the best case to represent the defendant, and that's why it has to get postponed. But that's all the recent updates that have come out of this situation. I was going to let you guys know that the trial did start today and I was going to break down the trial coverage as it comes out but again it seems like it's going to take place at a later date now but of course when the updates do come I'll be sure to keep you guys updated on this whole situation. But let me know what you guys think of this down in the comment section below, give the video a little like and if you want the latest drill, street and music news out of the UK be sure to hit the subscribe button and the notification bell. It's been your boy Ape Hancho and I'm out.